How's it going? I'm good. But listen, I need to show you something. Over there on the table. Recognize him? Yeah, his name is Victor Cost. He's old school black ops. My guess is he's here with the CIA. Well, if he's a mole, then he might be able to help us. From what I can tell, his location is somewhere near the channels. You might want to start by looking there. All right, I'll head over and see what I can dig up. This was a good find. Glad I can help, even if I am all dinged up. What are you doing here? Why are you working with Sentinel? And don't bullshit me. I know all about you. Oh, what is it you think you know? I know you're not just here to help Sentinel. So what else are you here for? I also came to help out an old friend. I believe you two already know each other. From Bolivia. You mean... Listen, I think you're better off talking to our friend. I'm just here to help. He can fill you in on all the juicy stuff. Now, I can't get any comms off Aroa, but this works on the island. It'll put the two of you in contact and tell you his last position. I appreciate the intel. Now get moving. This whole operation goes to shit if we're seen together.
Matchwood. Good to see you again. I used to be Matchwood. That was a long time ago. Call me Deep Blue now. Roger that, Deep Blue. Now I don't know what you're doing on a roll, but I'm here to help. I'd take your help any day. How is this hellhole of an island treating you? Yeah, it's just like Bolivia, only it sucks more. <laughs> Amen. Looks like you've still got your mojo. Glad you haven't gone soft since Bolivia. Yeah, you and me both. So what's the plan? Watch my back. I need to retrieve some data. So, what brings the mighty Sam Fisher to Aurora? I'm after someone called the Strategist. He's been linked to several kidnappings around the world. All military specialists. We don't know what he's up to, but we know he's here on this island. If I can get him in front of Congress, they should be able to authorize an invasion of Aroa. Huh. So they'll finally send in the cavalry. Right. For now, it's just us. Go take a look. <laughs> Midas. Tough son of a bitch. You really can't survive anything. But we won't if we don't get moving. Sentinel will know someone accessed this computer and they'll come looking. Keep an eye on me.
Get on that turret. I'll get us out of here. The strategist has him. He's using him for some special project. How is Midas involved in this project? It's not clear. All I know is the strategist is working on some kind of new drone swarm weapon. Look, the only thing I care about is getting Midas back. I'll help. But the strategist is not what I'm after. I understand. I'd be the same way if it was one of my guys. What do you think the strategist is up to? Why does he want Midas? I wish I knew, but you can bet your ass they're putting the screws to him. We need to make that son of a bitch pay, and pay hard. Don't worry, he'll pay. But first I need him alive and off this island so he can stand tall before the man. How do you plan to do that? My team tried to come in on choppers and they took us out with a drone swarm. Nothing gets in or out. I have an aircraft on standby, ready to come in. I'll figure out how to get it past that drone swarm. Every lock can be picked. Now, the strategist has Midas, but I can't take him down alone. You help me catch him, and I promise, he'll lead us to your guy. Partner up, huh? And why not? It worked in Bolivia. Huh. I got a location on some new intel. Need to be sneaky on this one, which means... You're going to have to master some new tricks. Echelon tricks. You're ready. Meet me at the rendezvous point. We'll get started from there. Nomad, you ready to earn your pay? Born ready. What's he up? According to the data we found, there is a power plant near that's just been reassigned and designated as a Skell secret project. The whole thing is classified and very hush-hush. Military and tech specialists have been secretly flowing in to work on the project. You think the strategist could be involved? Not only that, I think it's our lead to finding Midas. Then let's get moving. The strategist is careful. He uses servers with advanced encryption that we'll never be able to get past. But if we can knock out the power plant, the system will start to back up the files. The backup server has less encryption. That's the weak point. That's our way in. Got it. You survey the network and I'll take down the power plant. We'll split up. 
I'll prep the main facility while you take point on the pumping station and start working. Once you get the pumps down, head to the main facility. Let's do this. Strange as that. Let's go look. Yep, you should check that out. Uh, 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 I guess no, it was no. nothing. Hello there. Knock it off, okay? Can you help me find this equipment? I know exactly where you'll find that. Thanks a million.
Deep Blue. The pumping station's ready. I planted a bug on the strategist's computer. I'm ready whenever you are to start the show. Roger that. I'm headed to the main facility now. Get ready for fireworks. I found a weakness in the pipes. Target them and it should take down the whole plant. Is that gonna give up my position? Use a silencer to cover yourself. The impact will only trigger a minor leak. You should be clear until the plant goes down. Shocking. Uh, all clear. 
We ought to have night vision. Oh! Sharp. There are signs of possible enemy activity. Almost done. You set. I got my dancing shoes on and I'm ready to party. Hey, hey, hey! Stay alert! We got company! Set on your end. Deep Blue, this is Nomad. Are the files transferring? I hear you. Five by five, just got a little situation. The strategist is shiftier than I thought. The server switched and the backup started. I only got a few files before I was cut off. Did you get anything useful? I got something you're gonna wanna see. What is it? Anything about Midas? Head to the server room. I'll have the data waiting for you. <laughs> Sure that thing's not gonna fry your brain? Jesus. Relax. You don't have to wear it. Oh, relax. All of our asses are on the line if this plan fails, and so far your project hasn't delivered. You're a smart man, Stone, but you lack vision. Wonderland requires vision. Start the test. May I present Project Claw?
It's a promising start. Sure. Against dummies. But it's got to work in the real world. Against real targets. Oh, it will. Well, so you say. I do say. And when I speak, the world listens. Though I'm not surprised that someone like you can't understand that. Perhaps when Claw is complete, you can use it to finally put down the rebel insurrection you can't seem to manage. We don't tolerate failure, Mr. Stone. Is that clear? Crystal. Sir. Good. That's enough. Shut it down. What the hell was that? The tall guy who looked like death was the head of Sedmel. A guy named Stone. The man in the wheelchair acted like a superior. I bet that's the strategist. That sounds right. You find anything about the location of Claw? The project is massive. Somebody must know something. I like your thinking. I got a list of some names from the PC, all with ties to Claw. Any mention of Midas? Not yet. But if we split the list, we might be able to find something. Got it. Let's get moving. I'll be in touch. Bastards killed his wife. No sign of Van Dyke anywhere, though. That's what they're calling beehives.
have to die. She was innocent. She had nothing to do with this, nothing at all. Uh, uh, uh. It's all right. I'm not here to hurt you. This... all this is my fault. Rhonda would still be alive if I... if I hadn't... I'm so stupid. I killed her. I killed my wife. That's not true. No? Listen, your wife was protecting you. She believed in what you could do. Oh, God. Oh, Rhonda. My sweet Rhonda. There is a lot on the line here. And I need you to work with me. Just do it for her. Okay. I'll help you. She would have wanted that. You know something that can take down Claude, don't you? Tell me what you need. We can help each other out. All my research is stored in a server at the solar power plant. But if you can get me there, maybe I can wipe it. And then they'll be running blind. Lead the way. approached with a job offer. They wanted an algorithm for their factory drones. Why did they come to you? I'm an expert on bee behavior. Know all about swarm psychology, how to recognize and influence it. You didn't know they were building weapons? Not until it was too late. The situation escalated. They attacked me. I didn't know what else to do. You know that PMC, Pallet, and Nine? Well, they're here on a row and...
All my research is in here. The alarm will trigger when I start to wipe it. You'll need to cover me. My world is shattered. I... I just need to keep going, to honor her. Make sure my work doesn't fall into the wrong hands. So, how were you involved with Claw? 
I developed the algorithm, the language that made the drones able to behave autonomously. I gave them the power to think for themselves. Is there anything I can use against them to stop them? The only thing that can stop the algorithm is a virus. Corrupt the communication, and you defeat the swarm. This will overload the processors, but you'll need to access their relay to make it work. Thank you. Now, there's a bounty on your head. You'll probably be safest with the outcasts. I know a few I can call. When they hear about Rhonda, maybe they'll help me avenge her. Maybe. Now you take care of yourself. Nomad. Deep Blue. I think I might have found a way to destroy Clough. It comes after us. We have to be prepared for the worst, and that's definitely the worst. Tell me about it when I see you. Roger that. I'm near Holly McKenzie's location. Have any intel on her? She's listed as an animal behavior specialist. PhD. Ornithology. A what now? She studies birds. Flock behavior. Migration patterns. Sounds a bit left field, but she's on the claw list. Well, I guess I'll have to figure it out then. Mackenzie? I've already told you I don't know where my daughter is. I'm not from Sentinel, in case you haven't noticed. I'm here to talk about Claw. How do you know that name? Who are you? I want to meet with a strategist. I gather you work for him. I don't know who he is, and I don't care to. I'm being forced to work like everyone else here. I'm trying to put an end to all this, but I'll need your help to do it. Why should I trust you? I don't even know who you are. You mentioned something about your daughter. If she's in trouble, I can help and prove I'm worthy of your trust. My daughter, Ruby, she's going through a rebellious phase. Spends her time sabotaging Sentinel drones and holding illegal drone races. Well, rock on, right? But Sentinel's wising up to her. They expect full cooperation from me. Ruby's safety hangs in the balance. So what can I do? You can convince her to come home. She might hear you out, if you try. After all, you aren't me. Got it. Now you should go home and wait there. Just tell me where to find her. For a rebel wrapped up in illegal drone races. Ring a bell?
must be, Ruby. Who the hell are you? A simple thank you would suffice. I could have handled them on my own, thanks. Anyway, what do you want? You don't look like a drone racer. Name's Nomad. Your mom sent me. I'm not coming home. Your mom and I made a deal. Rescuing you was the only way I got her to agree to help me. Do I look like a damsel in distress to you? Um... My mum works for Sentinel. Did she tell you that? Besides, I'm busy preparing for a race. This thing's bigger than you, kid. There's no time to lose. I need you to cooperate. Hey, that's not how you negotiate, old timer. Chill. Look, I have something I need to do before I head home. Since you're being generous with your services, maybe you can help me with it. I'm listening. Cool. There's a series of antennas that have been emitting a strange signal recently. The signal's interfering with the races. My guess is that it's linked to new drone tech they're testing at a nearby camp. What do you want me to do? Destroy the antennas. Cause mayhem for Sentinel. Sounds straightforward. Where are the antennas? I don't know. The only way to find them is to follow the test drones. That's what I was doing when they swarmed me. Their network key will pinpoint which antennas they connect to. Extract a drone's motherboard, and I'll tell you what to do next. No, can you hear me? Am I coming through? Nomad? Who is this? Nomad? Can you hear me? What the? Ruby, is that you? How'd you get this frequency? It was a bit of a puzzle. Your encryption is top class. Don't worry. I doubt anyone else could crack it but me. Did you call just to brag? Wanted to give you a heads up. You can send me the network key by phone. It's a lot simpler. Uh, right. How do I send the thing over the phone? It's not a physical key, numbskull. It's a code. Insufferable kid.
Check your positions. Can I find that? Just flip it over. Should be printed on the bottom right. Got all of it? Yep. And I got a 20 on those antennas. <laughs> Sending the coordinates to you now. You sound very official. I've always wanted to try it. This isn't a game, Ruby. Jesus, you're so cranky. If you want to get the antennas fast, there's a chopper in the camp. Great. Where? Thanks for the tip. Antennas have been destroyed, and I'm mostly in one piece. You're a badass, Nomad. Yo, this badass has bigger fish to fry. I need you to play nice. Calm down, I'm home already. Mum's our back. Nomad's on the phone, Mum, it's fine. Mum said you've been talking. What about? Well, your mom is gonna help me take down a sizable skill project. Really? My mum? She works for Sentinel, she's a traitor. The world isn't as black and white as you think. I know my mom's just trying to keep me safe, but her good intentions don't justify human collateral damage. Yeah. 
The situation is complicated. I'll give you that. I trust you, Nomad. I'm kind of proud of my mum that she could help someone on your level. It takes real guts, and she knows she needs to correct what she's done. Nothing slips by you, huh? Nope, not really. Talk soon. And you're still working on that drone? Banshee. <laughs> what? Her name is Banshee? You gave it a name? It's a machine. Banshee's more than a machine. She's a trailblazer. What you're doing is illegal, Ruby. I don't want you to get arrested. You two seem to be getting along well. Ruby just refuses to listen. I'm at my wit's end. Nomad probably has better things to do than hear us arguing. It's your turn to step up. Nomad did what you asked. I study group pattern dynamics, animal synchronicity while migrating. It's useful research to anyone that wants to enhance AI communication. I helped develop the Drone Swarm Legion with it. The strategist has since asked me to improve our mutual project of interest in a similar fashion. Synchronized group communication that's never been seen before. Well, we have a plan ready to extract the strategist and bring him to justice. Is there anything you can do? I can help with Legion. Get you a ten-minute window so the plane can break in and then leave. It's not much, I know, but it's all I can do. I'll take what I can get. Thank you, Dr. McKenzie. Are you leaving now, Nomad? Need it elsewhere, kid. And you stay out of trouble. And stay out of my comms. Good luck, old-timer. You know what? I kind of feel sorry for Sentinel. Deep Blue, got some good news for you. Dr. McKenzie worked on the Legion Swarm. As she says she can get you a 10-minute window for your plane. Must be my lucky day. You should drop her a line when you can. I will. Thanks, Nomad. Oh, and just a tip. Keep an eye on her daughter, Ruby. Whip smart. Kids going places. To impress you, she has to be. I'll keep tabs on her. Over and out. did it again, didn't he? I don't want to talk about it. Listen, he's become pushier and pushier <coughs> with me, and I see him trying the same stuff with you. I'm not gonna let it happen again. I didn't come to a role with a retreated like this. I just need an exit strategy. Well, you don't have to do it alone. If you leave, I'm going with you. <coughs> I hope I'm not disturbing your work. The work can wait. Who are you, and what are you doing here? My name is Nomad. I have some questions for General Paxton. Oh, great. The old geezer went and got himself into trouble with Sentinel this time. I'm not from Sentinel, but there's some shady stuff going on. I just need to see if he's connected to it. The old man always grabs his fishing pole and heads out about this time of day. He has a watering hole around these parts, but he never catches anything. I don't think he's much of a fisherman. Oh, yeah? Where's this fishing hole of his? He's pretty secretive about it. And there may be snapshots of it in his office, though. Feel free to take a look. Will do. Thanks.
must be some fish here. Looks like we got some fresh meat on Aroa. Paladin Nine's here. Anything happening on the naval base today? Man, you know ain't shit going on here since the blockade. They can't even launch recon patrols. Fuck recon patrols. Seems like somebody's lying about their fishing trips. But why? Ugh! <laughs> 
there was another bombing. We lost a couple of people in it. It seems the last of the data was uploaded from the drive. You should have everything you need. Very good. The funds should be in your account as we speak. Thank you for your service, General. I look forward to future updates. General Paxton. You can't sneak up on me like that. You almost gave me a heart attack. Say, you're... You're one of Pharaoh's guys, right? I just uploaded the stuff from the drive and just sent it to him. I... We should be all square. You're pathetic. Who the hell do you think you are? I was a four-star general. Never volunteer information, general. You carelessly gave up the name of your accomplice. Oh, shit. You're a ghost. Look, what I did, I, I did for the good of my country, right? We need new warfare technology to protect America from its enemies. But in the process, you turned yourself into one of America's enemies. You used your position to justify acts of treason. Listen. If you had even the slightest idea of what I've sacrificed for America, you'd piss yourself! Well, I respect your rank. But I don't have to respect you. Now this... This needs to end. Am I making myself clear? Good. Because I would hate to come back here.
wouldn't be pleasant for either of us. Blue. And why would Claw need a legal advisor? That doesn't make sense. I'll see what else I can dig up. Yeah. There's gotta be more to this story. Let me know what you find. Will do. You Stephanie Burgess? Who are you? You don't look like Sentinel. Name's Nomad. Found your name tied to the Claw Project, and an individual known as a strategist. I'm investigating the matter, and I have some concerns. Keep your voice down. I don't want people to hear us. Let's get out of town. We need to find some place safe where we can talk. You don't look like an outcast. Are you here to stop Claw? I'm not an outcast, but yeah. Claw's far too dangerous to stay under Sentinel's control. I'd like to help you, but I can't tell you anything. They have eyes and ears everywhere. 
anything I say will be traced back to me. What can I do to protect your safety? I was planning on running away from all of this, but in order to do that, I need to disappear from Sentinel's database. If you can erase my entire existence from the Sentinel files, I can talk a lot more freely. I'm not trying to be paranoid. It's super important. Just lead me in the right direction. Thank you. I'll give you a burner phone. Call me when you're done. Don't worry. It's encrypted. Where am I headed? There are boats on the shore just west of Liberty City. Take one and you'll be able to reach the naval base. That's where my data is being kept. Thanks. I'll call you when I'm done. Specifically? No, but I know that it's where they keep my profile. It's heavily guarded and equipped with a mortar, automated turret, and drone carrier. It's all very modern. All very useful. Thank you. Server room, Northwest building. Got it.
Done. Might want to double check the records. Stephanie, I've cleaned the slate for you. You've been scrubbed from the system. Thank you, Nomad. This means the world to me. Think you can talk freely now? Yes. I'm sending you coordinates for where we can meet. And once there, I'll tell you everything you need to know. Thanks. Looking forward to it. Stephanie, where are you? Stephanie, where are you? I'm sorry, Nomad. I won't be joining you. I can't. Wait. What? Why? I have no choice. I need to tie up all of the loose ends. I need you to disappear. Forget we ever met. Oh, you've got to be shitting me. She's not tipping off the strategist about our activities. Yeah, let's tread lightly. Speaking of Stephanie, listen. I just interrogated one of the commanders from the claw list. Learned something interesting. Laid on me. Burgess has gotten pretty chummy with his bodyguard of hers. A fellow by the name of Carl Sekulich. As part of Claw's VIP security detail, he probably knows where she's hiding. Carol Sekulich? He's on my claw list. Yeah, I guess that narrows down who I'll be investigating next.
Blue. I'm near Carol's camp. You got any intel on this guy? Just a bit for now. He's a wolf commander who is in charge of VIP security for the Claw Project. That's not much to go on. When I get any more leads, I'll give you a holler. Sounds good. Too many men! We need to stop them! something on Carl. Before he got recruited into the Wolves, he was part of a Russian spec op. Part of the Bodark unit. Does that ring any bells? Bodark? Yeah. Yeah, I heard of them. They were one of the Ghost's top priorities a while back. How were you able to link Carol to that so quickly, huh? I called up Cust. I wanted to see if he knew anything about the Wolves. It took some work to get it out of him, but apparently, this Carl guy, a 
applied to Paladin 9 soon after he defected. And get this, he got rejected for being too laid back. Now that sounds like somebody I need to meet. You must be the ghost that I've been hearing so much about. Are you Karol Sekulich? I am, yes. If you know who I am and you know what I do, you're being awfully cavalier. Especially for a wolf. I just heard from Stephanie. Sounds like she gave you some trouble. So, you two are close, huh? Well, I've been through worse, but I'm certainly not too keen on her right now. Listen, I can lead you to her. I can even make sure she gives you all the info she has on Claw. But first, I need a favor. I'm listening. The thing of it is, I'm looking to disappear. Defect, as it were, from the wolves. The corpses in the mission schedule. It was all falsified as part of my ploy to escape this life. That's a pretty severe plan. That's not even half of it. I wanted others to think I was hot on the ghost's trail. I had plans to stage a whole ghost operation at the dam, where I'd die in a transformer explosion. But then you show up. And you thought that dying at the hands of an actual ghost was more credible? Can't say I disagree. Something like that. Glad to hear we're on the same page. Do me a favor. Place these on the body. You'll also find a radio device on the body so that we can communicate. Once this is all finished, I'll tell you anything you need to know about Claw and the strategist. Works for me. Hawkins and Grant are dead. We're running out of offices. Same for me. Hold up, I'm gonna... I'm gonna go see what's what. I'll come along. Find them, and I'm gonna bust their ass. Roger that, let's get them.
You know. I was watching from a distance. I wouldn't let you do this completely on your own. Okay. So what do we need to do before we blow this thing up? Well, there are two things to check. First, you must falsify the visitor log, signing my name to it. Secondly, I need you to disarm the failsafe device for the Transformers. It doesn't matter which order you do them in. All right. By the way, whose radio is this? It's mine, but don't worry. I put it on a channel that nobody in the unit uses. Heaven forbid someone in Sentinel is on the line. I don't want them listening in on us. Anything else I need to know before we blow this popsicle stand? No. Feel free to light it up. So I've helped you out with your problem. Can you help me out with mine? Let's cut through the bullshit, shall we? I'm the head of VIP security for CLAW and the tactical advisor for the strategist. I consulted on classified spec ops tactics. I'm guessing it involved one of your friends. Midas? Possible. 
whomever it was had a difficult time with interrogation. Quite difficult. Where can I find him? I will send you the details and everything I know about the strategist stronghold. However, and I cannot stress this strongly enough, do not attempt to breach the facility without the full knowledge of Claw. Duly noted. Stephanie and I are set to meet out in the wild soon. I'll send you over the location. When you get there, I'll make sure she gives you all the intel she promised. Looking forward to it. Deep Blue, got a minute? Sure, what's up? You want a jam? No, nothing like that. How Look, I found Stephanie spider? Burgess. Listen, I figure you're gonna want to be online for this. Things are about to get I interesting. Here. They There's just no wanted to talk. Like nothing I else. Mean. Just relax. I hope you have a good explanation for all of this. If they come after us, it'll be your fault, Carol. I understand. Listen, I'm on your side. If we can just get to Claw, nobody will come after you. Being a ghost is great and all, but you have no idea what you're up against. Look, I work for Lomax Faro, the developers behind Claw. One of the founders is Michael Lomax, a U.S. Senator from the Subcommittee of Defense. He's been using his influence to create mandates and fund his own research and projects like CLAW. So he uses taxpayer money to fund his CLAW project? And he has mandates to develop it? That complicates my job. The other co-founder is Lomax's associate, Faro. He's the strategist. And he's been using all of that money, control, and power to further this project. Seems like some very deep state stuff. It is. Whichever U.S. official it was who sent you after Claw is thinking several steps ahead. Either they know about the strategist's plans, or something else is brewing. I wish I could tell you more. That should be enough info for you to get started. I'm sure you'll have a lot of fun digging through this shit. It's time we go. The island is locked down. Where will you go? Don't worry about us. I know a couple of places that will keep us safe. Keep close to your radio, though. I'm sure our paths will cross again. Deep Blue, you got all that? Yeah, and I don't like it one bit. This wasn't in the briefing. Now, if you don't mind me asking, who sent you this assignment? The CIA. Came through the same way the rest of my assignments do. Come to think of it, the timing seems a little suspicious. I was asked to capture the strategist not too long before their role got locked down. Uh, it just seems too convenient. What if someone in the CIA knew a role was going to be on lockdown? Hmm? Maybe there's more to this mission than simply capturing the strategist. What if it's an extraction? Look, if they knew about a role, they knew their activities might alert the ghosts. Or worse, that we would intervene. If me or any of the other ghosts got our hands on Pharaoh, we'd lean on him, his friends in the Senate, and all their private interests. It'd be a bad, bad scene. Yeah, this is deep state stuff of conspiracy theorists and crackpots. I know it's hard to believe, but you might be working for the wrong side. You think about it. If slush fund money can control technology like Claw, and if it's dictating company and DOD movement, then there's no telling how deep it runs. <laughs> that would be inconvenient, wouldn't it? Hmm? Look, I'm gonna continue with the mission. But once that's done, I'll only hand Pharaoh over to my most trusted contacts. Because you're right. Something smells fishy. Agreed. Find anything? I found construction blueprints to show a way in. You figure out what we need to extract the strategist. I leaned on a few of the strategist's people. They told me what we need to know. The blueprints show an emergency escape route. We're gonna need to lock the place down first, or the strategist might bug out. I got access codes from one of my friendly little chats. I can lock this place down tight. Good. We're also gonna need to take out the SAM launchers before we can call in the Paladin aircraft for exfil. Well, there's an engineer named Holly McKenzie who's agreed to disable the drone swarm guarding Aurora. Contact her when you're ready to dust off. 
Should get you ten minutes to clear skies. After that, you're on your own. Then we're set. I can get to the strategist, but I'll need a distraction. Done. Whatever it takes, I don't give a shit. The faster we take them down, the faster we get to Midas. Mm, remember, slow is smooth, and smooth is fast. Don't let your emotions walk you into a trap. You don't worry about me. I'm buttoned up. Good. I'll meet you at the base. Let's move. Check that out. What the?
Sam's been destroyed. Roger that. I'll call in the cavalry. I'm gonna go check it out. Hold off on shutting down the swarm.
Why don't you just die and make way for the true Wonderland? I want to talk to a government official. I know things, valuable things. Let's negotiate. What? What the hell? What's going on? Playtime's over. You think you can stop me? You're the old world. I can control an army with just my mind. I am the future. Oh. That's better. Can you get authorization for a ground attack now? You keep the pressure on here. I'll make sure he gets in front of the right people in Washington. Other than that, I've learned not to promise anything. You know, I'm sure there's some people at Echelon who'd love to meet a snake eater like you. Yeah, well, we'll have to find out another day. Have some unfinished business to take care of. Right. That's what really matters. Never leave a brother behind.
What the hell? Midas. Come on, you son of a bitch. Hey, look what I found. Holt? God damn, it's good to see you, brother. Thanks, boss. Well, you look like shit. Yeah. <laughs> well, you don't look so good yourself. They, uh... They put a hurting on me. I don't know how much more of that I could have taken. Where's Weaver? Weaver didn't make it. Hey. There's nothing any of us could have done. He was a good man best but the mission continues now I know you're both banged up but I'm gonna need your help one way or another you with me good because this thing is far from over how things were going to go when Sentinel came in.